Hello, Jumpstart friends. So today we are working with the Play-Doh that we made the week, the earlier this week in our centers, which I have right here. And we are going to be making animals. So for me, I am going to be making the snake from our book. So let me try. My Play-Doh is not the best, but I think you can see it. So I'm going to be making a long tube and be making our snake. So here we have our snake. And Jumpstart Friends, I want you to get creative with this, so use your Play-Doh in any way you want. Pick any animal from our story today and make your Play-Doh into the form of that animal. So I made our snake here, and I will see you next week. Bye, Jumpstart Friends! Hello, Jumpstart Friends! It is Miss Sophia, and we are wrapping up our Jumpstart session today. So we got to do so many fun things things today. I know I thought they were all super fun. I hope you thought they were super fun as well. Friends, we got to learn today if objects were shiny or if they were dull with our special Let's Find Out About It guest Miss Tony and Miss Jennifer. And you even got to talk about what you might do with your Play-Doh that you made last week with Miss Tony. And you got to read our story, Raccoon on His Own, with Miss Nadi. There were so many fun things. I think I really liked the Play-Doh. But we did so many fun things today, friends, that I want you to take a few seconds and put your thinking caps on. Really get to thinking about which part was your favorite. So which one do you think, hmm, I would love to do that one again? So take a few seconds, let's think. Okay, and once you have one, you can turn to a friend, a family member, a sibling, a teacher, a peer, a, f a classmate, anybody that you are with, you can go ahead and turn that to them and tell them what your favorite part was. And friends, as always, you can turn to me if you do not have a friend or anybody around right now. If you are just by yourself, you can go ahead and tell me your favorite part. So you can go ahead and once you have your favorite part and once you have that person, go ahead and let them know what your favorite part of today's session was. Okay, friends, and coming back, I hope you got to pick which one. Maybe it was the same as mine, where you really love playing with Play-Doh. Friends, we have only two more jumpstart sessions left. So we have our orange flower has bloomed and we see that there are three more left. But jumpstart friends, we know that we just finished a session all together. So we got to read Raccoon on his own one more time today. So that means that I'm going to take our flower and I'm gonna put it right next to our orange flower to show that we only have two more sessions left and that two, our blue and our orange flower, two flowers have bloomed. So I'm going to put that right on there. Okay friends, we have our orange and our blue one and that means we have two more Jumpstart sessions left before Jumpstart is done for this year. I hope you are so excited for these two friends because I know I am. Okay, friends, next time we are together, we are going to be reading a brand new storybook called Puddle Pail. This story is all about two dragons named Ernst and Sol, and they are collecting different things. And we are going to learn what the Puddle Pail is. I hope you're ready to learn all about this with our Jumpstart friends, and I will see you guys next time.